Welcome back to my channel. This story was penned by Benedetto Vitali in Clutch Point News. Dion Sanders' son, Shiloh, is in the midst of drama during the offseason. The Colorado football team's starting safety is reportedly facing some nil drama after surprisingly filing for bankruptcy. The word is that Shiloh Sanders filed for bankruptcy after a Texas court judgment proclaimed that a former high school security guard is due $11.89 million for an incident that took place in 2015, per Katie Cheshire of Westward, University of Colorado football player Shiloh Sanders, son of CU head coach Deion Sanders, filed a bankruptcy proceeding to avoid a Texas court judgment against him in favor of a former high school security guard in the amount of $11.89 million. The security officer, John Dargene, worked at the high school Shiloh Sanders was attending at the time. The alleged incident between Dargene and Sanders all began when Sanders was acting out in class. It led to a physical altercation between the two after Dion Sanders allegedly requested for John Dargene to collect Shiloh's phone. John Dargene was a security officer at Focus Academies in Dallas, Texas, where Shiloh attended the Focus Academies High School AAA Academy. According to legal documents obtained by Westward, in 2015 Shiloh allegedly attacked Darjean while Darjean was executing a disciplinary action against Shiloh after he was being disruptive in class. Darjean filed a lawsuit after the now Colorado football star allegedly slammed his elbow into Darjean's chest. Shiloh Sanders allegedly continued to hit John Darjean after he fell. Reports indicate that Darjean was taken to a hospital with severe and permanent injuries. Darjean filed a lawsuit in Dallas District Court in 2016 as he had sustained severe and permanent injuries including a broken neck, damage to his cervical spine, permanent neurological injuries and irreversible incontinence, according to his January 2024 filing. Eventually, Shiloh Sanders and his attorneys claimed he acted in self-defense. This is an ongoing legal battle and as of now there is no telling how long it will last, or what the verdict will be, Colorado football was the center of the spotlight after hiring Deion Sanders as head coach. The team played well early in the season, but they failed to end with a winning season. Now, the program hopes to improve and at least make a bid for a bowl game. The Buffaloes have lost several key players through the portal, but they've also acquired some key players as well. Additionally, many believe that Shadur Sanders can elevate his level of play and push this Colorado football further and beyond. It'll be a tough for the Buffaloes though as they're now playing in a loaded Big 12 conference. It'd be awesome to see Colorado football make a crazy run to a playoff spot. However, it's more likely they finish with 6-7 wins and participate in a bowl game. Please subscribe, comment, like, share and follow for more content. Please support my channel send it to Cash App, Dollar Director 327. Thank you for your gift it is greatly appreciated. Thanks for watching.